हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल एक्सीलेंट कोचिंग वी आर स्टार्टिंग विद द थर्ड चैप्टर व्हिच इज द बेसिस ऑफ ह्यूमन बिहेवियर सो वील स्टार्ट विद एवोल्यूशनरी पर्सपेक्टिव फर्स्ट व्हाट इज एवोल्यूशन इट इज द ग्रेजुअल चेंज इट इज एन ऑर्डरली चेंज इन आर फिजियोलॉजिकल बायोलॉजिकल एंड बिहेवियर करेक्टरिस्टिक्स एंड दीज करेक्टरिस्टिक्स आर मोस्टली एसोसिएटेड विद द सर्वाइवल एंड रिप्रोडक्शन uh for example the ability to avoid predators the ability to find food the ability to defend our young ones these are certain characteristics and abilities which are usually uh associated with our survival and our reproduction and uh, passing on the genes from one generation to another so the person who is fit or we may call a person who is fittest of all has those characteristics you may have heard the term survival of the fittest so who is the fittest here fittest is the person who has these abilities of passing on the genes from next generation to another and has those characteristics which are necessary for survival and reproduction so evolution occurs through the process of natural selection nature selects those who are fit for uh, the environment who are able to adapt to their changing environment the three important features that tell us that our human species has also evolved what are these three important features these are number 1 we have a bigger and developed brain now our brain capacities have increased our cognitive uh, capacities have improved our way of perceiving things memorizing reasoning problem solving and use of language these capacities have improved uh, is better than before what our ancestors used to have secondly we are able to walk upright now we all know how we used to walk earlier but now as the human species has evolved we are able to walk upright third thing is the uh, uh, opposable thumb that we have a free hand with an opposable thumb so these are the three features of human species that tells us that we have survived through uh, generations and we have evolved and adapted to our environment and in the next video we'll talk about biological perspective of behavior thanks for watching